I'm Bill Barajas. United Airlines says their flight from Vancouver to Houston's Bush Airport ended with many passengers sick. Some of those passengers tell us they were held on the plane while the CDC was notified. KPRC 2's Gage Golding is live at Bush Airport. Gage, what happened on that plane? Yeah, Bill, it's more of what happened before everyone got on that plane. United Airlines says that every single one of the passengers that got sick just got off of a cruise, all right? So we know that 75 of the 163 passengers aboard United Flight 1528 just got off a cruise. So 75 people were on the cruise. Of that, 25 reported some sort of illness. Take, take a look at this. Uh, 25 people getting sick halfway through that five-hour flight. The Houston Fire Department saying they had to evacuate three of those people. All of the sick passengers were checked out by paramedics. They were reporting symptoms of nausea and vomiting. Here's the good news. No one was taken to the hospital. One passenger that spoke only with KPRC2 says the pilot came on the loudspeaker letting them know once they landed that the CDC was now involved. This is where it got weird is uh, he got over the speaker, but he came out to us and he said, hey, in my 25 years of flying, I've never seen anything like this. We have been quarantined by the CDC. We, nobody can exit the plane until the CDC lets us off. And the, as soon as you get off, you got mobbed, wanting to know if you had any symptoms and did you want to be triaged? And I said, what symptoms are we even talking about? And he said, coronavirus-like symptoms. I talked with the Houston Fire Department, United Airlines, the FAA, and the CDC. So far, no one is willing to kind of cough up more information about what cruise line they were on or exactly what illness this could be. But, Bill, we're doing some investigating. We're looking into what this illness could be and what the potential impacts could be to the people that were on this flight and potentially exposed as well. I'll have that report coming up for you this evening at 10 p.m. I'm live at Bush Intercontinental, Gage Golding, KPRC2 News. Gage, thank you.